It's been a while, friends, since I talk, took y'all to uh, Dogwood. So Eddie and I go going to ride over there and see if there's anything new that we can show y'all. Uh, I almost feel like I can see the light at the uh, end of that big old tunnel. And you know, we just hoping it ain't the train. <laughs> okay, we're here, y'all. Uh, I mean, the yards look terrible. The, uh... <laughs> these things. What are those things called, Daddy? Those trash things? A nice big old dumpster in our dumpster, front Dumpster, yes. I mean, and look look at all the stuff we have no garage space to put. But so y'all please overlook all that because one day oh, I do want to show you what Eddie, uh, I, I uh, had the pleasure of my family and I shooting a 4th of July special and we shot it here at Michael's Outdoor Kitchen and it looked so bad back there. But it, it, come on, Eddie, let's. Um, but you said something about visualizing something. What were you talking about? Okay, I want I want you to. Uh -huh. We're going with the um, Charleston green. Yes. For, for the, the shutters. shutters, and um, I know you want the front door of that too. But how about if we did it, kind of the shade of the front door, the, like the shade of the the roof that kind of kind of like a blue yeah aqua green color make your door pop and all that hey mikey uh you know i would i would think about that eddie i would think about it here comes gus oh, oh, oh my gracious oh, oh, oh my babies i have missed y'all i have missed y'all so bad <laughs> oh you know <laughs> oh, I love y'all, I love y'all, I love y'all. Uh, I don't know if y'all know this, but um, Gus and Max are living with Eddie. And Eddie lives in this apartment up here over the garage. And Lulu lives with me. Mikey, Mikey, what's up, baby? Oh, um, Oh my goodness, they surprised me. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, Usually so, Gus picks up on when the car comes in. So Eddie and Mike really got in here, y'all, and rolled up their sleeves and made things happen back here that was going to be on camera. You know, before we had wooden steps, but we decided to change those to brick and I love that. It kind of anchors the house. Yes, and we are definitely getting railings on all of the brick stairs so no <laughs> one has to worry about that. Well, yet. I have to hold no on one. to Eddie's shirt <laughs> when I go up and down them. But look, Eddie and Mike started right here cleaning out these flower beds and um, Eddie and I went to the nursery and just picked up all these beautiful little colorful plants to plant out here. And this, it used to be my bird's room where Ladybird lived and Dixie. But since they're both gone, that's going to be mine and Ed, Eddie's hobby room. That's where we're going to paint and shell and do stuff like that. Now, all this is original to the house. And the men just cleaned out that bed and put these uh, oak leaf hydrangeas set in there because they get pretty big. And, uh, oh, look, Eddie, this, what is, what is, remind is me one more time. This is a passion, passion fruit. fruit yes. Passion fruit. They opened up overnight. They have opened up. <laughs> Can't wait to see what happens. With this it. is like that clematis or something like yeah, that. Uh -huh. Did I say it right? Yep. It reminds me of another word, so if I get yeah, them mixed and you up. Make me nervous. <laughs> I make you nervous. <laughs> I make my own self nervous, Dave. All right, so all this was just. It was just. I don't know what it was. I don't even remember. There, there was nothing. There was nothing. Yeah, there was nothing, <laughs> nothing here. And uh, 
Eddie and Mike made it so beautiful. So beautiful. So when we shot the special, you never knew <laughs> that uh, the rest of the house looked like this. Gus. Gussy buddy. And tell everybody, Eddie, uh, again, this this too is a form of uh, yeah, this is hydrangea. A lime, limelight, hydrangeas. A limelight. Now this doesn't get as big as the oak leaf, right? Right. No, these will. These are just like regular hydrangea. And then we've got some Nantucket blues. Now where's the Nantucket blues? Right that, there in the middle. So they're, it's they're kind in of the a middle of one. each each yeah. cluster. We put. And then um, you love the fern, so we put in some queens love. in the fern that will spread in the area. I love, love, love ferns. I especially love like wild ferns. You walk in the woods and you just see these wild, beautiful ferns everywhere. Um, I think we need to get a hammock. To go between those trees. To go between those two trees, don't y'all? Yeah. You just have to hope you don't roll over and <laughs> fall into the creek. We, we can make that Mikey's bedroom. <laughs> Okay, well the painters, the painters are supposed to be, Eddie fusses at me when I pull up weeds and just leave them there so they can reroute and go another place. <laughs> what, what's on your hand? Excuse me, but it was a bug. <laughs> so, uh, there's not a lot going on, is it, Mike? What's the painters today? Like every other day, right? Well, there's a lot of painting to be done. Yes, it is. It's a lot of painting. But they're completely through with the upstairs, aren't they? Uh, nope. They've still got one more coat on everything to do. Oh, God. So, <laughs> I'm kind of shaky on this side of the house, y'all. This used to be really beautiful over here. and But I see that uh, Eddie and Mike have got this coming back. There used to be an archway hanging up here with climbing roses, and uh, it was really beautiful. It was nice, maybe not beautiful, but it is on its way to being beautiful. Uh, it kind of reminds me of a downtown square. It does. It's like some of the private squares that you never get to see, but they're definitely there. And um, I remember <laughs> when my precious Bubba got married for the second time. We did it here. And we emptied out the water, filled it full of ice, and covered it with raw oysters. And people would come over here and just stand and crack the oysters and eat them. And, talk and just have a good time. Uh, sweet memories. The flowers, the flowers are less and longer than the marriage, Eddie. <laughs> but that's all right. It was, it was a wonderful experience for us all. Uh, we've got to go get our fish and put in here. I'm not putting in koi because uh, the critters out here, they they just eat stuff like that. So I'm just gonna put some cheap little goldfish and hopefully watch them grow. Yeah, um, they, you know, they, they got pretty big in the in the last Yeah, little pond in the last had. little pond, yes. Uh, but those koi get so big and oh my goodness, they they can those birds can spot a koi and uh, they go in for the kill. And I tell y'all what, I have missed my chicken so bad but uh eddie and i've been talking along with michael now this is this is our pump house this is we had a jacuzzi here when we first built the house it's gone uh, but we're we're gonna rig up some kind of chicken coop coming off of uh the pump house. Yeah, I mean, it's a great, great little uh, structure to. Yes. 
So I'm counting on Eddie to kind of draw me up a... I don't have to tell y'all that Eddie can do anything, right? Did I, did I ever tell y'all that? <laughs> so I'm kind of waiting on him to kind of sketch me what he's got in his head. There's a lot of plants that have got to, but y'all got all this cleaned out, Eddie. Yeah, well, I think which this is, is wonderful. Gonna maybe and we're gonna grass. reclaim this and make it more part of the yard, right? Yes. Okay, well, let's go in, y'all. Uh, the painters are the only people here working today. Is that a worm? Nope, stick. <laughs> We really love to uh, paint our porch ceilings like it's a continuation of the sky. Uh, a soft sky blue. In fact, I think I'm gonna put that color uh, on the ceiling off my bedroom, off of our in, bedroom. In the sitting room, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Hola! Como <laughs> esta? Oh, y'all, this is so different from our last house. But actually, our last house, I didn't, I didn't contribute very much to it because I was on the road. I was never here. So other things were being decided for me. So I have been able to be heavily, heavily involved in this project. And I wanted everything white, everything white, even our furniture. But it's kind of an off-white, right, Eddie? Kind of a dirty white. Um, or is it white? No, it's kind of cool white. I mean, so, um, you know, I said, <laughs> I wanted to redecorate by maybe getting a new pillow. I don't wanna have to get new furniture. Uh, just give me a new throw and a pillow and I'll feel like I've uh, got a, a new setting. But uh, this is our island. Mm -hmm. And uh, Steve had to take all of our cabinets out because I had had them faux painted and you couldn't put paint over the, this type of paint over the faux painting. So he had to take all of these cabinets out, take them to his shop and strip them all, which was a job. And you know, you can see where that archway is. Well, it's not archway, but the opening. That used to be part of the porch, but I wanted a bigger eating space because our family has grown so since Michael and I built this house. So, we knocked down that wall and uh, went into the porch and we did the same thing in the living room. Because when we all get together, I think it's like 24. I really hadn't counted. Have uh, you counted that, I think that was about what went on vacation, so. Yes, we just <laughs> got back from vacation, y'all, <laughs> last week. Uh, Miracle, a miracle, but we managed to get every one of our children and grandchildren under the same roof. I couldn't believe we actually pulled it off. All right, so this room ended right here. And the porch was like a U shape. Uh, this is where we had our outdoor table for eating. So the porch is a lot smaller, but <laughs> I just feel like we need more inside than we do on the outside. So let's come see if the painters have started putting up color yet. We had new wood floors put in and the wood floors are just beautiful. No color yet, Eddie. And I sure didn't want to show y'all because I kind of uh, stressed a little bit over what color we should go here. But um, I have to say this, well, there's color upstairs. 
but there's really no color down here except for this room. Well, your your um your your upholstered stuff is gonna have color. Yeah, it will have color. All right, let's see. This was the little outdoor area that the jacuzzi set. And it was strange. It um, had a fireplace, a working fireplace. And so I really wanted to kind of recreate um, my River Bend bathroom here at Dogwood. So you can see this is our sofa and everything will be here. And this is probably where we'll spend most of our time. And then our bathroom. And we put down a pretty gray, it's flat. Uh, but I'll be bringing y'all back. It looks like we're almost done with our bathrooms. And that was the toilet closet. And this was our shower. And because this, the toilet room was bigger, we flipped them. So that's gonna be our shower and this is gonna be the toilet closet. And again, to me, the best part about the room being was our bathroom and our closet. And that's what I wanted to recreate. So this is our closet. And our laundry room right here. And very soon, uh, the people will be here to install a dry cleaning rack. Uh, because when you've got tall ceilings, you've got to figure out a way to use that and make it functional. So that's what we're doing here. So no color today. <laughs> you ready to go, Eddie? Ready. I think we got some cooking to do. I love you boys. I love you boys so much. And I love you, little girl. I love you, little girl. Uh, I don't know, you, you're not gonna be able to, yeah, you can kind of see it. The young man that's doing our floors suggested uh, uh, a, herringbone a herringbone pattern for the foyer. And I talked with Eddie about it and he decided yes. And it, it will kind of separate the, the foyer from the living area. And of course, my antique doors fit up here perfectly. And uh, it's gonna be real pretty, but the rest of the house is a traditional straight, straight board. But I do love this um, herringbone pattern and they should be back very, very soon to, as soon as the painters are done, they'll be back to sand the floors and then stain them and put their final finish on them. Where is your brother and your sister? Come on, y'all. Come on, guys. Come on, Lulu. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, y'all. It's Paula Dean. Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell to be alerted when I post a video. Love and best dishes, y'all.